Well, good morning, everybody. How is everybody this morning? Good morning, class. Just kidding. We are taking Brynn to school right now, though, because she has to go to class. So, that's what's going on. And then I have to do boring work stuff. Eh. But, you know, what do you do? So I woke up this morning and I am freezing. Currently I'm warm, but this morning it was cold. Probably has something to do with the fact that I spent the last week in Phoenix, in Phoenix where it was 70. Excuse me, I'm burping toothpaste. Yum. I didn't swallow any of it. I don't know. Maybe it was just a fresh burp. So, yeah, that's what's going on. And then in a couple weeks, we're going to be way up over there. You see those mountains way in the distance? Way over there? Yeah. Those ones way off? That's Snowball. We're going to go snowboarding for Bryn's birthday. So, in a couple weeks, join us and we'll go snowboarding. You got anything to say before you go to school? It also is free on your birthday. Oh yeah, Snowball is free on your birthday. I think most mountains are though. Most mountains will probably give you a pass for your birthday. Call and find out. It's worthwhile unless you have a summer birthday. Then that kind of sucks. Yeah. Mine is April 4th, so mine is right at the end of the season. They usually close the week of my birthday. So, try to sneak up there and do some riding. We will see. Have a good day, Bran. I will try. Hello, man. So I'm down here at Magic 99.1 to go chat with Lisa and pick up my planner because I left it in her studio last time I was in here. See if we can figure out some stuff for the morning show, possibly. So we sat down and spitballed for a little while, see if we could figure out some more ideas. We have a couple, um, just kind of have to work on them and see what rolls best. Thinking like a Just Ask Jesse. Um, segment where people can call in or write in and I will give them advice. It might not be good advice, but I will give them advice because it's just Jesse. So we will see. So here we are at my storage. Um, I actually came to pay my bill, but I figured while I was there I would throw this box in my storage so that I'm not driving around with it because that's just kind of senseless. Little tiny storage with stuff. That's pretty much it. See anything you want to buy? Probably sell it to you. Shadow Valley Ranch in Prescott. I just stopped by my buddy Tatum's house to see how he was and see his daughter. I haven't met his daughter since she's been born. She's 10 months old. So we've both been a little busy. So this is climbing back out of here. He actually used to live back here a long time ago, and then, you know, has lived other places since then. Um, but when we were kids and in high school, and just out of high school, if I remember correctly, his mom lived there. Um, so, it was weird being back in that garage, and back in that house, and back in his room, and on the property. It's, it's, all, it's all the same, except for there's different toys in the garage now. Now he's got quads instead of dirt bikes and fast cars, now that he's got a family. <laughs> So I had to check out the new toys. And they remodeled some of the inside of the house, so that was really cool. Um, I left my camera in the car. I haven't seen them in, you know, almost, gosh, really? Almost a year? Yeah, I guess so. Murray! Well, at the homestead. What are you sniffing, Mar? There's some in there? What is it? So I was on my way back from my friend's house and I was thinking about radio stuff and trying to think of what good ideas are and, and what what it is is it's going to be Just Ask Jesse possibly. Just Ask Jesse. I need to learn to enunciate. <laughs> I've been on the radio. I should be able to enunciate. But no. No. So Just Ask Jesse and it's going to be something like um, have a question? Need advice? Is curiosity kicking? Just ask Jesse. Most likely a slanted and completely terrible answer. But remember, it's just Jesse. I don't know, something to that effect. What do you think? Stupid? 
Sounds a lot better in my head. <laughs> it really does. What was that? What was that? You're a weirdo. Do you know that? Do you know that you're a weirdo? Hey, weird dog. No digging. Come on, let's go do some work, get something done. So yeah, brainstorming, brainstorming, brainstorming radio ideas. Talented. So yeah, brainstorming radio ideas and show content, because we want to get me on there, but we got to find a way. First of all, what, puppy? I fuck a dog. Is that your food? Sitting there being such a good dog, just waiting for her food to be done. She listens really well when she wants to. Too smart for her own good. Oh, I just thought about this. Lily, I left the broth at your house. I didn't bring it home. Yum, you guys want some? A little dinner soup? Mar wants some. You want some lettuce, Mar? <laughs> Still now? Okay, here you go. Eat it up. Go ahead. Well, everybody, I hope you guys had a most wonderful day. Sorry, mine was kind of boring. Um, a lot of work on the computer and, you know, talking with Lizo, which I wasn't going to record, of course. I mean, I guess I could have, but that would have been kind of awkward. <laughs> Here, Lisa, let's chat. Here's my camera. Um, so, just got stuff done today. Hopefully, I get some reply emails and phone calls back tomorrow so I can actually start getting some work done. Um, currently, I'm in just a holding pattern waiting to hear from them. So, hopefully, that'll get cooking tomorrow. Uh, I just found out that Haley's not going to be able to make the snowboarding trip, so that really bums me out. I understand that she's really busy with, you know, she's really busy with school and dance, and I get that. And just the kid's never gonna have a chance to actually be a kid, unfortunately. Um, she's gonna go straight to being completely busy all the time because it's not gonna get any better once she's in high school or college. So that's good though, because she's, well, it's not good, but it's good that she's accomplishing so much, and that's what's important to her. And so that's okay. She's very goal oriented, and I am very proud of her bummed that she's not going to be able to make the snowboarding trip but I don't know hopefully we can figure something else out um, that was her present from me and my grandpa Orly or my grandpa Orly me and my dad her grandpa Orly so uh, I'll have to try and figure something else out because it's already paid for so we shall see what happens uh, Lily got a new phone today so that makes me really happy she finally got her her school check in so that she can <laughs> start taking care of some stuff that's probably way overdue for her like a new phone her old one was horrible so horrible we could barely even talk half the time so I'm very happy that she got a new phone and she's sitting at home playing with it and sending me messages and video messages and ooh it does this and ooh it does that so that makes me really happy it's something that I've wanted for her for quite a while now uh, what else is going on Mari was a good and lazy dog today. She didn't do anything but lay around and sleep for most of the day. I think the transition between Phoenix and here, it's like it wears her out. <laughs> as, as weird as that sounds. Like, I know I'm really cold today because I've been in Phoenix for the last, you know, week. Um, that and it's kind of chilly up here, so I've been really cold. I've been cold all day. Uh, it's one of those, like, not too cold, but just chilly and not able to warm up. You know, right now I'm wearing a hoodie, a jacket, sweatpants, you know, everything I can. Um, I don't have my beanie on because I didn't feel like going upstairs to get it. Otherwise, I would have it on. So, I think Mari has the same kind of issue. I think that, you know, all the excitement with seeing Lily and hanging out with Bailey, even though they're not, like, best buddies or anything, you know, they're still dogs. And then, you know, coming back up here, she relaxes, and oh, then tomorrow she'll be ready to tear apart the creek and, you know, go hiking or something. Uh, I have to do a bunch of research and see if I can find out some good... Um, skits, content, uh, whatever you want to call it, 
so we can get the radio show thing going because that's something that I just really want to do. Um, it's a passion that's that I've kind of had since I was younger, and I've always liked the whole radio thing. And who knows, maybe I should have gotten into it at a younger age and made a profession out of it. But I definitely at least want to see where this goes. Um, Lisa's excited about it and really wants to work with me, so that has to be a good sign, right? Because she's really good at what she does, and I really like working with her. So hopefully something more turns out of it. You know, at least a even even if it's not you know paying a bunch of money, I'd like to still do it, and then maybe it can open doors. Uh, but I would really like to you know turn it into kind of a paying gig, even if it's you know live remotes or um, special events or uh, promotional trips, etc. Who knows? So that's what's up. I hope you guys had a most wonderful day. Um, please don't forget to tune in so you can check out everything else. One video every day for at least a year. Uh, I am on day, let's see, I just posted 37. Today's 38, day 38. So I'm almost there, right? <laughs> um, I'm excited. If you guys could help support me on all my endeavors when it comes to the YouTube thing, that would be great. It, it takes a lot to do this every day. And I know but nobody else really has to deal with it because I'm the one that does it. Um, some of those groups out there and channels that you see, you know, they have people that help them. They have people that help edit for them. So all they have to do is shoot or, you know, vice versa. They shoot and the other person edits or they edit and the other person shoots. or And it's just me. Um, I don't know where I was going with that. But your support is, is very appreciated. I thank you very much. And I know that, you know, you, you look down at the videos and there's not a bunch of views on them yet. And, you know, I don't have a ton of subscribers on my channel yet. But, you know, it's new. It's only... 38 days old. I mean, I think I have a total of like 42 videos total. Um, so it'll get there at some point. I'm not worried about it. I would like to have, you know, a ton of subscribers and, you know, people to check it out every day and be able to share my world with the rest of the world. And maybe it'll get there someday. But if not, it's just a personal goal for me. So I'm happy with whatever it is. I like doing it. What are you sniffing at, puppy? She's over, I don't know, even, you guys probably can't even see her. She's over there trying to sniffing out something. So, anyway, that's what's well, up. If I forget to say goodnight because I'm going to go inside and read and do whatever, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so, I'll say it right now. Have a great night, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.